Hey guys, it's Bill from Southport Chev, and today we're going to show you the RST package on the Silverado. What is an RST, you might be asking? Let's go through that. So, it is the sport model of the Silverado. A um, few things that kind of make it that is uh, the one thing up front, you get the full color match front end. So, the color match grille, color match bumpers, it adds the LED headlights where the standard package of the Silverados just have the halogen um, reflector lights. So, the LEDs are a little bit brighter there. Um, you get LED running lights too, which is pretty nice. This one, so there's a few different levels of the RST. You can get it as a more basic equipped truck with uh, fold up middle con uh, seat and without power seats or any of that stuff. Or as you add up the convenience packages, you can get to something like this. So available on the RST, you can get the front and rear clearance sensors. Um, as well as when you get that, it adds the blind spot monitors into the mirror. So this mirror actually has a little icon. It shows you if somebody's coming up in your blind spot that you can't see. So kind of a nice little safety feature. Hence why they call it the safety package. Um, inside the RST, you get some kind of unique trim. So the door trim, um, console trim is actually a really nice shade. This one, again, being an upgrade package, it has the full leather interior, the power raising and lowering driver seat. Um, you can get these with cloth or leather with heated um, seats and steering wheel, as well as the automatic climate control. Just again, this one being an upgraded package has a few more goodies inside. Um, also available on the RST is the sunroof and both sound systems. So again, depending on what you're actually looking for, for interior options, you can get them a lot more basic or you can get them pretty decked out. Um, yeah, back seat wise. So the RST models also add the um, rear seat um, power outlets, as well as the option of the rear seat storage and fold down armrest in the middle. So you've got an armrest that'll come down with a couple hold, uh, cup holders. And then this will fold up for some storage, a little bit of a bin as well. Um, other stuff on the RST. So again, you can get these a little more basic or a little more decked out. The standard wheel and tire package on these is an 18 inch wheel. Um, as you upgrade, you can upgrade to 20 inch wheels or even the 22s like this one has. Uh, Chevrolet is really good at offering a few different styles and varieties of wheel and tire options. Get this out of the way. Um, other neat features, so they have the power lowering tailgate. You can do it actually off the key fob or from behind the truck. Um, LED bed lighting is standard in the RSTs as well as you do have the option of a built-in inverter in the back. So if you're running your Margaritaville or tailgate partying or even just using some tool, power tools and stuff like that, you can turn that on and actually run a built-in inverter. Gotta love that. Um, towing capacities on these trucks, so they range between about 7,000 pounds in a four-cylinder turbo or a V6 option. Um, they can get all the way up to over 11,000 pounds when you get into a 5.3 with the max trailering package. This one having the 22 inch wheels, it doesn't have the max trailer package, so it tows between nine and 10,000 pounds. So depending on what you're towing as well, um, we can usually spec one up to actually tow almost whatever you need, at least half ton wise, whatever you need. Um, other neat features, so again, with the LED lighting, you get the full LED lighting package. So the third brake light, the tail lights, the headlights, the interior lights are all LED in this truck now. And yeah, if you want, we can head inside and check out a few more features. So inside the RST, um, you get some pretty sweet features in here as well. Um, you get the tilting and telescopic steering wheel, which is kind of nice. So a um, variety of different seating positions. You might need that a little bit closer or a little bit further away. Um, on the left-hand side, the, these ones do have the tow haul as well as driving modes. So you can actually have a sport mode or um, off-road mode or normal, um, as well as a tow haul, which I'll show you in the center information display. Um, most features are fairly standard on this truck, but again, when you get the more basic models, you don't get stuff like the automatic dual zone climate control. As you get the convenience package, it adds stuff like the um, heated seats, which have three different levels, and you can heat just the back or the back and the bottom, as well as the, uh, the dual zone auto climate and the heated steering wheel. That kind of all comes together as one package. Um, the infotainment in this truck is pretty sweet as well. So it has, this one has a satellite radio built in. The more basic models just have AM, FM, and Bluetooth audio. Um, but yeah, you can actually swipe between the different home screens. Um, it has a ton of different apps like Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, trailering, which you can actually have trailer presets and even do stuff like test your trailer lights and things like that right off the screen. Um, the options to pull up your camera or your hitch view, which actually zooms in. It's some pretty neat stuff. It's a very user-friendly system with a lot of technology in it. Um, also has the quick links too, to jump from audio to phone, um, climate, navigation. This one doesn't have built-in maps, but you can do the Apple CarPlay or Android Auto. Um, these are available in a five passenger or a six passenger, as well as a smaller cab, the double cab or the crew cab. So this one has the bigger center console. You can actually get these with a full up middle seat, um, which will have storage in the top and the bottom as well, if that's more along the lines of what you're looking for. 
Um, so yeah, that's kind of the most of the stuff inside. As you can see in the back seat, these things are super spacious. Um, they added about three, four inches of leg room between the previous generation and the new body style trucks. And even the double cabs are actually a lot bigger than they used to be. So if you're interested in more information or want to come down and see us, South Fort Chevrolet, Fort Saskatchewan, we got RSTs.